Hello everyone, welcome to the tutorial on envelope tracking. Uh, this is a short tutorial and if you people are interested in going into more detail uh, content of this tutorial as well as uh, other tutorials on RFIC design, analog design and similar tech topics, please go to our website that is www.poweramplifier.net. Let's get started with this tutorial. Uh, first of all, we have to define what is envelope tracking. So envelope tracking in simple terms is a technique to enhance back of efficiency of a power amplifier. Uh, I hope everybody is aware of what is power amplifier. In case you don't know, power amplifier is a block used in a transmitter to enhance the signal such that it can be transmitted through an antenna in a wireless systems. The question comes what is back of efficiency and why it is extremely important. So for that purpose we will go into the characteristics of a power amplifier in terms of output power and power added efficiency. So this is a power amplifier which is uh, driven by a con which has a constant supply voltage and as one can see that the output power has a uh, peak level and then as the output power gets lower the efficiency degrades considerably. This means that if the input signal is changing and the corresponding output power levels are also changing the average efficiency is very low of uh, uh, such a power amplifier in the case if the signal is amplitude modulated. So this is the fundamental motivation behind uh, 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 that we need to have power amplifier to have good back of efficiency. Now the question comes why we need high back of efficiency in the first place. We will come to this reason in a couple of moments but first of all please consider these two signals. The second signal which we see in the diagram is an amplitude modulated signal and it has very low amplitude as well as very high amplitude. The signal above of that signal is a frequency modulated signal and one can see that in that signal the amplitude is constant. So the lower type of signals need to have power amplifiers which are efficient not only at peak levels but also at back off levels. And this is the fundamental motivation of back off efficiency enhancement. The reason is if we go into more details is that modern wireless signals have very high peak to average power ratio and peak to average power ratio is a parameter which is used to characterize the dynamic range of an amplitude modulated signal. So if the amplitude modulated signal has a very low level and it goes to a very high level this will have a correspondingly higher peak to average power ratio. In signals like uh, used in communication standards like LTE and also in 5G communications, they have very high peak to average power ratio and therefore we need power amplifiers and techniques which enhances the back of efficiency. The solution for back of efficiency, one of the solution is envelope tracking and it is also known as supply modulation. The reason it's called supply modulation is that we are constantly changing the supply of the power amplifier based on the signal which is coming at the gate of the amplifier. And the word envelope tracking is used because essentially what we are doing is we are tracking the input signal envelope. Here in this figure we can see the effect of the change of the supply with respect to the envelope of the signal. And this shows that this simply shows that if we change the VDD of the power amplifier with respect to the envelope, we get a set of curves of output power versus efficiency such that at the back of level also the peak power is still high. This is very different in uh, to the case when we have a single supply and in the single supply as we saw earlier when we go at the back of level the output uh, uh, when the output power is low the efficiency degrees, degrades considerably. So this is the fundamental principle of uh, envelope tracking also known as supply modulation. And here we can see that how the supply modulation or envelope tracking saves us the DC power or the power which is lost. Here we can clearly see when we have a constant supply voltage a lot of power is burned when the 
output power requirement are low and in the case of envelope tracking as we can see on the right there is a huge amount of saving of dc power at low input power levels so this is the fundamental principle and the working of envelope tracking if you want to go more detail into this particular uh, uh, topic on, the, on in this particular lecture please go to our website www.poweramplifier.net and if you have any uh, further questions please write it in the comment section and do subscribe to the channel so that's all thank you very much